Everybody, hello out there in, in Facebook land and YouTube land. This is Brock and Ryan at the Focus uh, nightclub, apparently, right there. Got the graphic on. This is a 10-week sermon series where uh, Terry and I will be preaching on a number of things. Then there's like these little booklets throughout the week that Brock worked really hard on writing all the stuff for these in there. And um, all kinds of stuff to follow along with. Very interactive kind of like thing with the sermons and with these. And we're going to be doing like a weekly, midweek, little mini podcast type thing where we'll kind of kick around different ideas, uh, different questions and kind of thoughts from from each week. Dive a little deeper, some you can interact with and, and then hopefully inspire you to have similar types of conversations with Family around the kitchen table, um, some guy at Gary's bar that you're sitting beside. Literally, I mean, come I on. like that. Think about it. Think about it, all the cool ways it can graft into your real life. You know, I love the kitchen table thing. You know, even we want you to join one of these, by the way. But there's growth groups going on where you have these micro conversations with uh, new interpersonal relationships. But there's a lot of people that won't won't jump into that uh, growth group situation for schedule reasons. But you can do this with your family. This is so cool because you have this broad sweeping understanding of what we believe. And it, I think it's a, a real tool to the believer to have, uh, let alone your personal relationship with Christ, but the people that you're interacting with. And by the way, just for the record, I've, I've looked through this thing and, you know, you never know, man. Ryan is actually the one that, Ryan and Terry, I think. And maybe Ted. No, just you and Terry, right? Definitely not Ted. Definitely not Ted. Okay. <laughs> Ryan and Terry put this together. You never know. You know all when you walk through in the Christian bookstore and there's just stuff to buy. I mean, it doesn't have anything on this. So we might be looking at a little uh, sermon series that could spread. I hope I'm not going to offend. But the biblical literacy needs to go like this much in the right direction. Yeah, Offensive? Okay. No. I no, mean, no. No. Because yeah. we're not talking about you. Yeah. We're not talking you. about like the other the guy. The other guy the other watching the video. Beside you. The other people. Not you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, well, me, uh, my biblical literacy needs to go this this much in the right direction. So, I mean, like, think about it seriously in, in practical terms. This is wonderful. We need this as a church body to to spread the light. These are these are think of these as like my dad used to wear these old, really cool retro tool tool belts, like in Tool Time or whatever that show was called. You just got to pull out the home tool. improvement. Home yeah. improvement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. He used to wear those, by the way. Yeah, a little sentimental. Mm-hmm. Anyway. And yeah. now his son wears a super deep and yeah. super wide V-neck. My daughter came down with this much cleavage, it's right back upstairs. Yes. Each yeah. week his V-neck is going to get deeper and wider. So Actually, sure I'm going to try to get this guy to wear a V-neck. And then, then the starts, It's going to start very small. We went off the road. Focus. Focus. Bring it back in. Your dad had a tool belt. V-neck. Epic literacy. Share it with your friends. Get with it. It's going to be really good. And much more mature than this promo video. Uh, Much more serious. Somewhat more mature than this promo video. (laughs) Expectations low.